Nearly 200 severe thunderstorm warnings were issued Thursday afternoon, just, just yesterday afternoon, across more than a dozen states. Now, the storms erupted in East Texas, about 100 miles east of Dallas, just before sunset. And Fox weather was live with severe storm coverage when a tornado formed over Tyler, Texas. During these storms, hail as big as baseballs, three inches in size over Henry County, Illinois, when the storms were there through the upper Midwest. And then wind gusts reported as strong as 81 miles an hour in Cook County, Illinois. That's the same county as Chicago. 325 storm reports in total from the past 24 hours across eight states. A lot of people will be cleaning up today. You can see this large area, again, extending from Texas all the way up through the upper Midwest. These are areas that had some form of severe thunderstorm damage. Now, some places had too much water. Others had to deal with a lot of wind. The storms both last night and Wednesday well, for Wednesday night and all the way through Thursday happened after dark. That adds to the danger because when you cannot see the storms coming, it really makes it difficult for folks to prepare. Here's a look at some of the lightning sort of illuminating these storms. The uh, ones through Oklahoma and Shawnee were particularly terrifying. Uh, Oklahoma Baptist University in Shawnee took a direct hit from tornadoes that blew through central Oklahoma. That was on Wednesday night. One student described her harrowing experience hiding in the basement of a chapel as the tornado roared through the campus. We could feel the tornado hit. Like we're in the basement and we felt the ground rattle and our ears were popping. So it's just, it was a different feel to a storm when everyone was so scared because you had seen what it had done and what was forming coming in. Every person on this campus was okay. And that's really what's important. Everything in that room can be replaced. Sure. What a story. You can see some of the damage there behind her. Fortunately, no one was hurt. The university president said it was the worst national disaster there, or the worst uh, natural disaster there for the university in its 113 year history. And it's just ripped apart so many pieces of property there on the campus. Shawnee's situated about 40 miles east of Oklahoma City. No stranger to severe storms there, though. They have a lot of buildings on campus that do have basements for people to shelter in. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.